Okay, the first exercise is going to be a suitcase squat. On a suitcase squat, we're going to do eight per each arm. And you actually want to keep your chest up, sink your hips down, and keep the kettlebell close to the ankle at the bottom of the position. Here we have the slingshot. The slingshot is going to go around the center of the body, about the hip level. Make sure you keep the feet on the ground. Make sure you feel the energy, and you're going to do eight per direction. Next, we have the halo. Halo is going to go around the center of the head. When you get the kettlebell around the back side of the head, make sure you open up the chest, keep the kettlebell low, and you're going to do eight each direction. Now we have the shoulder pry. The shoulder pry, you're going to go ahead and exhale out quickly. Push the kettlebell above your head and back as far as you can. Straighten out those arms and then return to the middle part of your chest. Now we have the knee pry. Knee pry, you're going to start by bending over, placing your elbows on the inside of your knees, pressing out. Go ahead and squat down in the bottom position. Pull your hips all the way through your knees as best as you can. While in the knee pry position, you're now going to start working on ankle uh, mobility by shifting foot to foot, side to side in a lateral fashion. Make sure that you keep your heels and your feet flat on the ground as you do it. We're going to go eight each direction.